hi welcome to glass catering and um, today i just want to show how i use up my cabbage this is like leftover cabbage i want to make a meal something that i can eat with rice or with beans or with potato something or even spaghetti and um, like an all-purpose uh, sauce that that um, you can make with um, your leftover cabbage or leftover ingredients so these are the uh, what i'm going to use i've got my cabbage there which has been nicely diced up cut it anyhow anyhow you like i've got carrots i've got a tomato um tomatoes there the leftover tomatoes um i've got some fresh tomato there you can you have to combine something to make something out of it um there's gonna be onion the onion is somewhere there i've got my spring onion as well and um, this is um king prawn i've spiced it up with with my lovely uh, uh hot seasoning which is mainly um my herbs dry chili uh, just mix it all up i'm gonna fry it fr dry fry it no oil and then um, this is my homemade seasoning in that little mortar there which is uh, my usual garlic uh, herbs ginger a pinch of anise seed and then i just pounded it up i, I did add a pinch of um, haricot beans as well i just want to flavor it all up so that is um the ingredient that will be used and don't forget i've got some carrots and there these are my leftover carrots as well so i'm going to use it all up so i will <clears throat> i'll let you see how everything went thank you for watching hi welcome back so um i put the onion onion um fried the onion and added my the seasoning the the seasoning in the uh, the one that, that was that i was pounding so i'm gonna leave it to cook up a bit sorry 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 <clears throat> i did reduce the heat and um, before before then i did cook the the prawn and tomatoes and set aside so they've been just cook as I said cook it with very nothing no no oil I cook that and set aside and then I'm carrying on with the remaining so that while that is frying as you know carrot takes a longer time to cook so I'm gonna add the carrot now okay together Then I'll cover it and leave it to carry on and I'll come back in a minute thank you for hi welcome back to glass catering so we're going to carry on with the remaining um, <coughs> um, preparation that is the tomato um, it's actually some tomatoes bit of pieces of tomato inside in tomato juice so you can use fresh tomato or you can use your tin tomato uh, any leftover as Sarah was saying so that is it that goes in now so your leftover tomato goes in followed by the cabbages there you go I'm gonna just throw it in and now we will cover it if you like you can put a little bit of seasoning uh, but I did put a little before before now whatever you like if you want it hot you can add it um, you can add it anytime really so we're gonna leave it there and let it carry on and uh, cook and combine together we're going to leave it to cook and combine um, then later we're going to add the going to add our 
uh, king prawn which was cooked together with um, our fresh tomato so it shouldn't take long I'm just leaving it to cook and combine and the next thing will be to add your uh, prawns thank you for watching hi welcome back to gloss gate train we're going to add the prawn that's the prawn cooked prawn so if this is the first time of watching our video please don't forget to like share and follow for more updates <coughs> So you can see it's all coming together now from a little humble cabbage to what we got now. Isn't that amazing? Look at that. So it's a bit bland, no color. So I've got something to add to it. I've got my green onion, spring onion, and I've got some rosemary. I'm putting the rosemary because I, it's handy. I just had it. You can use anything you like. So we're going to sprinkle a, some drops of our greens. On the cabbage leftover. That looks amazing. Yes, I'm going to taste it in a minute. I'm going to leave it to simmer for a few minutes and then I'll taste it. We're going to serve ours with rice. <clears throat> we eat a lot of rice in this house. <laughs> I don't know about you, but you can serve this with anything you like. Look at that. So I'm going to give it a little few minutes. And it will be ready for sampling. Thank you for watching. Hi, welcome back to Glass Catering. And our sauce, stew, or whatever you want to call it, is ready. So that's amazing. We're going to sample it. If this is the first time of watching my coming across my video please don't forget to like share comment and follow for more updates thank you for watching so we're going to sample it now I put it in my little sampling bowl there including the prawns so when is that looking that way if you like some people like their stew um, thinner so that's quite thick if you want you can just put a drop of hot water or cold water or just mix in some corn flour and add it and leave it to cook but i'm happy with the way this one is so i'm going to sample it now <clears throat> that's my little sampling spoon okay let's go It's amazing, very nice. It is very, very nice. So instead of throwing away all your leftovers, you can use it to make something amazing. Look at that. Your visitors will love it. Look at that. It's amazing. Thank you for watching. Thank you.